Imagine if some of the objects and structures that we see around us were not of human origin, but instead were created by ancient alien civilizations. How would that change our understanding of our place in the universe? The question of whether or not we are alone in the universe is one that has yet to be fully answered. Scientists have found that there are billions of galaxies in the observable universe, each containing billions of stars, and this makes the existence of extraterrestrial life highly likely. Yet, there have been many speculations about the possible existence of aliens on Earth. Some people believe that aliens have visited or are currently living among us, and that evidence of their presence can be found in ancient texts, artifacts, and structures. Some believe that aliens have been monitoring and influencing human civilization for thousands of years, and that they may have played a role in ancient human history, and there are even theories that aliens have been in contact with people. However, the question of whether aliens actually exist is still open as there is currently no concrete evidence to prove their existence. Regardless of whether or not aliens exist, the potential implications of their discovery would be enormous, fundamentally changing our understanding of the universe and our place in it. Hey everyone! Welcome to the Random List channel, where we list interesting and insightful content. Today's topic is one that has fascinated humanity for centuries as we take a closer look at five artifacts that some believe may be evidence of the existence of aliens on Earth. From ancient inscriptions to mysterious spheres, let's embark on a journey to explore the unknown, and see what secrets these artifacts may hold. Before we jump into the list, if you found these kinds of videos helpful and exciting, please give us a subscribe, like, and comment to help us grow and deliver more listing of interesting contents. First on our list is the Klerksdorp spheres. This. These are small, round objects that were found in the pyrophyllite mines near Ottostel, South Africa. They range in size from less than an inch to over 8 inches in diameter, and are estimated to be between 2 billion and 3 billion years old. Some people believe that these spheres may be evidence of ancient alien visitors to Earth. In general, it's believed by some to be an alien artifacts because of the following reasons. 1. Their perfect spherical shape, which is unusual for naturally occurring objects. 2. Their occurrence in pyrophyllite, a sedimentary rock, which is unexpected for such objects. 3. The fact that some of the spheres contain concentric layers, which is not a common feature in naturally occurring objects. 4. The presence of grooves and striations on some of the spheres, which some people believe were made by an intelligent agent. And 5. The sphere's estimated age of 2.8 billion years old, which is much older than the oldest known human artifacts. However, scientists have a different explanation. According to scientists, the Klerkstorp spheres are a naturally occurring mineral formation likely concretions of a mineral called pyrophyllite. They have been found in association with pyrophyllite deposits and have been found to be composed mainly of silica, with trace amounts of other minerals such as iron and manganese. Next on our list is the Georgia Guidestones. These are a group of granite monuments located in Elbert County, Georgia, USA. The monuments contain inscriptions in several languages that some believe to be messages from aliens. They argue that the inscriptions are a form of a code or a message that couldn't have been made by humans. In general, it's believed by some to be an alien artifacts because of the following reasons. 1. The monuments inscriptions, which are written in eight different languages, including ancient Egyptian hieroglyphs, and Babylonian cuneiform which some believe were chosen by an extraterrestrial intelligence. 2. The precision of the monument's construction, which some believe could not have been achieved by human technology at the time of its construction. 3. The monument's alignments, which some believe were designed to align with astronomical events such as the solstices, which could be interpreted as a message from an extraterrestrial intelligence. 4. 
the monument's mysterious origins, as the identity of the individuals or group that commissioned the monument's construction has never been revealed. However, scientists believe that they are a modern construction. According to archaeologists, the purpose of the Georgia Guidestones is believed to promote a new age of reason, and to provide a set of guidelines for a sustainable future. The inscriptions on the monument are a set of moral and ethical guidelines for human behavior, including themes of population control, balance, and responsible use of resources. The monument was constructed using precise engineering and the alignments of the stones are based on astronomical events such as the solstices and equinoxes, which is why some people believe that the monument may have had an astronomical or astrological purpose. However, the monument's creators have stated that these alignments were intended to serve as a compass, calendar and clock for future generations. The third artifact on our list is the Dropa Stones. These are a collection of small stone discs that were found in the Bayankara Mountains of China in 1938. The discs are about 7.5 inches in diameter and 0.5 inches thick, and they contain etched hieroglyphs that some believe to be a form of alien writing. They argue that the hieroglyphs are too advanced for ancient human civilization and that the disc's composition is not found on Earth. In general, it's believed by some to be an alien artifact because of the following reasons. 1. The discs have grooves etched on their surface, which some believe are an ancient form of writing and could contain information from an extraterrestrial intelligence. 2. The discs are estimated to be around 12,000 years old, which is much older than the oldest known human artifacts. 3. The discovery of the stones was accompanied by a legend of the Dropa, a race of dwarf-like beings who lived in the area and were said to have come from the star. However, scientists and researchers have conducted various studies on the stones, and have found no evidence to support the claim that they are of extraterrestrial origin. In fact, many scientists believe that the Dropa stones are a hoax, and that the inscriptions on the stones are not genuine. The lack of concrete evidence to support the claim that the Dropa stones are of alien origin has led many experts to conclude that they are not authentic, and that they were likely created as a hoax or a form of pseudoscience. The fourth artifact on our list is the Nazca Lines. These are a series of ancient geoglyphs located in the Nazca Desert in southern Peru. They depict animals, humans and other figures that some believe to have been created by ancient aliens. They argue that the lines are only visible from the air and it is a mystery how ancient people could create such precise lines without modern technology. Here are the reasons why it is believed to be an alien artifacts. 1. The Nazca lines are large-scale and intricate images that can only be fully appreciated from the air leading to theories that they were created with the help of extraterrestrial technology or as a form of communication with extraterrestrial beings. 2. The lines are of geometric perfection, which is difficult to achieve without advanced technology and leading to theories that ancient Nazca people could not have created them on their own. 3. The lack of evidence or records of how the lines were created and the idea that the lines depict images of alien spacecrafts and other extraterrestrial motifs further fuels the theory that they are of alien origin. However, scientists have a different explanation. According to scientists, the Nazca lines were created by ancient people of the Nazca culture, who flourished in the region from around 200 BC to 600 AD, the lines were created by removing the top layer of reddish-brown iron oxide-coated pebbles to reveal the white granite underneath. The lines are thought to have had religious or ceremonial significance for the ancient Nazca people. The fifth and final artifact on our list is the Black Knight satellite. This is an alleged object of unknown origin in Earth orbit. Some people believe that it is a 13,000-year-old alien satellite that has been monitoring Earth for thousands of years. They argue that it has been seen by multiple people and that it emits radio signals that are not from Earth. Moreover, here are the following reasons why it is believed to be an alien artifacts. 1. 
The Black Knight satellite has an unusual orbital path that some believe is not consistent with a man-made object. 2. The object appears to be highly advanced and not consistent with the technology of the time it was first observed. 3. There are various conspiracy theories surrounding the Black Knight satellite, including the idea that it is a secret military craft or an alien observation post, lack of concrete information, and radio signals believed to be of extraterrestrial origin and no clear evidence of it being a natural object. However, there is no evidence to support the idea that it is an alien satellite that has been monitoring Earth for thousands of years. Scientists believe that it is just a natural satellite like an asteroid or a space debris, a reflection of sunlight, only a hoax or an urban legend that has perpetuated over the years, misinterpretation of day 2 and that the radio signals that some people claim to have intercepted from the Black Knight satellite could be caused by radio interference from other sources such as Earth-based radio transmissions. So, there you have it, the five alien artifacts on Earth. While some people may claim that these artifacts are of extraterrestrial origin, there is currently no scientific evidence to support these claims. But it's always interesting to consider the possibilities and keep an open mind. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe for more content like this.